What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of the Minecraft server. So I'm just going to say right away, I have no idea what I'm going to be doing. I think I'm just going to be putting, like, working on my house over there. Um, today is going to be, like, a very kind of short episode because I got to get working here. Um, my passport actually came into uh, in the mail. I got to just go pick it up tomorrow. I, I, I missed it. I missed pick like it. I don't personally have it right now, but it's at the at the mailbox, and I, I, I guess I just missed uh, when they they came. They didn't even call. I don't know how they missed me or anything, and I don't know why they just didn't put it in the mailbox. But it's available at the post office tomorrow. So, and by tomorrow, I totally mean today, as of recording. Um, <laughs> as of recording, it's tomorrow. So, I am extremely tired. And first and foremost, before I continue, I'd like to just apologize. I know that tomorrow was supposed to be, uh, or yesterday was supposed to be Mailbox Thursdays, but as some of the people who follow me on Twitter may know, I was actually out at a concert. I went to go see Skrillex. That best, most, a big, it was the best concert I've ever, ever been to, hands down. Like, I've been to Crosby, Stills, Nash & Young, The White Stripes, Red Hot Chili Peppers, um, system of a down and now skrillex and it wasn't just skrillex it was like full flex uh tour there's a couple people uh, uh called grimes pretty lights uh diplo was there he threw on an amazing set and uh obviously skrillex himself and two other people i never really heard of so i just ended up drinking and kind of uh waiting for their their set to pass so i can kind of party at first it was really awkward because i was like um, I've never been to like an electronic concert before, or I guess what people call raves and that, and I didn't know what to do. So I just got drunk and then I ended up partying and I actually kind of jumped around and danced or whatever you got, what you want to call it. But oh, like all in all, I know a lot of people hate Skrillex and I know people are going to say, oh, boss, I'm so disappointed that you like Skrillex. It's like, Shut up. I like my music. Okay. I like Skrillex. I've liked him a long time before. I guess he was really, really popular. I don't know. I, I just like dubstep and not like shitty dubstep, like, you know, underground. Ooh, Skrillex too mainstream. Have you heard of this underground? But, and no, I don't like their dirty. I don't like dirty beats, dirty dubstep beats. But yeah, uh, I, at first, uh, yesterday, we were kind of just hanging around. Oh, my God. I something. At first, my friend and I, uh, we were just kind of hanging around and, um, you know, we like we were we were kind of awkward at first because you know like, we've we've only attended like rock concerts in this and there's a lot of people high and i'm pretty sure i got high just from like all the smokes because i definitely felt more than drunk last night <laughs> and um yeah we i don't know it was, it was pretty good there's a lot of people and i guess the most awkward part was like before it, it was like night and everything and you know everyone was like still kind of partying i Got some guy come up to me, and I was like, oh, God. It's happening. Some guy recognizes me. and Because cause I don't know why, but I, I will freak out if, uh, like, not, not not in a good way. Like, oh, my God, someone actually knows me. I, I don't know how I deal with it, to be honest. How I deal with someone recognize me in public. I've gotten messages before saying, hey, I saw you at the mall. I was like, oh, God. Oh, God. It's making me want to be a hermit, even though I know that. What, I, what I'm doing, I know I'm kind of putting myself out there, I guess. I, I never started my YouTube anticipating to ever gain or be this notorious, I guess. And I'm creeping up to 100,000 subscribers. And a lot of people want me to do like a milestone video. And I don't know. I'm, I don't, I've never really done milestone videos. I guess maybe I'll just... I don't know. I'll, I'll figure something out. Just to not really piss off certain people. Sibling. Uh what that should probably be enough but yeah it was it was overall amazing it was hands down the best concerts I, i've ever been to like i like as of recording right now my ears are still kind of ringing because of like all the fucking bass that they had there and yes me saying fucking was necessary especially for something like that so uh yeah it was uh it was amazing and i came home and i passed out and my Freaking legs are so sore from just standing so long, and I'm wondering if I kind of want to, like these around here. And if oh, oh God, cow, you scared the crap out of me, and I'm sad. 
I haven't played since I... I guess I can eat this. I haven't played since uh, I died there. So, I'm, like I said, I'm kind of... Uh, nah, that's not what I wanted. I'm kind of bummed out from my loss of all that delicious steak that I, that I used to have. So... But, yeah, it was... Uh, it was amazing, but now I got my passport. I'm kind of freaking out because, you know, I wasn't really fully prepared for it. I, uh, I honestly didn't think you'd come in <laughs> at uh, on time, so I wasn't really worrying about it. But now that I have a... Uh, uh, is this going to go here? Oh, no, that's not going to work. Uh, I forgot! What? You need a pickaxe for this half slot. I hope they seriously fix this in 1.3. Okay, so what I'm probably going to have to do then is this. Really? How? I thought you can do... Oh, you know what? Uh, fuck, I need a pick. But yes, yeah, so I'm kind of like freaking out because I don't have recording done for, for kind of the weekend here. So now I got to kind of sit down and I want to finish playing um, Mirror's Edge because that game is simply amazing and I do have some stuff ready like I have like a couple episodes but uh, you know I don't think uh, there will be thing like don't expect Minecraft every day uh, like I might not even do Minecraft for for the week there because I mean like I leave on Wednesday and I come back on Sunday and that also brings up another good point that uh, I don't know whether or not uh, we're going to be doing the podcast because Guna and myself are actually going to be out of town and we're not going to be coming back until uh, later in the evening there I know I won't be back until about uh, what time is it uh, is it up here let me quickly check uh, my ID Itinerary. Yeah, I won't be back until like six o'clock, and <laughs> after that, I gotta. I'll probably end up having a rest because I mean, like, it's gonna be a busy weekend, and I'm I'm pretty excited about it. So, and the only thing that worries me is, I know some people are gonna know me. I don't know why that that bothers me. I guess I'm just like I said, I'm not used to fans or anything like that. And I hate calling you fans, viewers. There we go. So. I don't know. I, I honestly just don't know what to expect. <laughs> so. Uh, okay, so. But yeah, like, and not only that, but I mean, like. This, this isn't going to be like the only time I'm actually going to be out of town. Um, after that, I'm actually leaving to go for a little holiday and visit my friend out in uh, BC. And we're actually going to be checking to see if we're going to be moving there. Uh, this year not or, or next or something like we got to figure out what we're doing but you know we want to go check it out make sure that it's it's decent over there so uh, yeah that's gonna be hectic so I got to get not only get prepared for my play on con adventure but I also got to worry about the week after <laughs> it's it's gonna be a pretty freaking busy week for me so I'm I'm excited because I haven't actually had a vacation, like a proper vacation in over a year now, but uh, it's kind of weird now that I have like a different obligation rather than going to like a nine to five job. Uh, I got to try because I mean, like I've, I've seen uh, certain channels and what happens to them if you leave them kind of lingering for a while. And I want to avoid that at all costs. So for me what i'm going to be doing is like a lot of the minecraft stuff is probably going to be like pre-recorded during that week because i know a lot of people absolutely love minecraft so uh it's it's gonna it's gonna be pre-recorded i gotta get prepared for other stuff as well and during those like couple weeks i'm not gonna be able to do like uh, mailbox thursdays or triple a mondays or anything like that so you know like like i said as excited as i am to go on a, a proper holiday it's gonna be pretty darn hectic as well to uh make sure that I stay on top of everything. And I know a lot of people are going to be like, oh, just just take your time, take a break. <laughs> like I said, I've seen what happens to people who take breaks, and I want to avoid that at all costs. Uh, is this... Yep. Um... Hmm. I wonder how this is going to look. 
So we don't need anything here. Okay, so this isn't going to be too bad. I thought it was going to be a little bit worse, but I don't know if I should wait. Like, I, like the only reason why I'm doing this right now is I want to see how this will look with uh, with the regular um, the regular wood rather than waiting around till the colored stuff. <laughs> the new the new colored stuff. No, it's just you know I, I'm I'm excited about the the new uh, colors that are coming out. So. I gotta make. I want to make sure that this will look somewhat decent. But yeah, um, I'm kind of freaking out. I also, I'm not the best flyer ever. Like I, I get a little, I get like kind of anxious when I fly. So I guess what's gonna be happening is I'm gonna probably cry because I, I hate flying. But I, I did buy a uh, uh, Lego Batman on the on the Vita, like I said in the podcast. So. Hopefully that'll actually, you know, make me worry less and kind of just focus on the great the game rather than anything. But um, I don't know if I told this story yet, but basically, I remember I like like I said I'm a terrible flyer, but I remember one flight incident that uh, made me hate flying that one day is because uh, one time, like this is shortly after like 9/11 and everything, where all that that uh, the bad stuff was happening and you know they were doing like a lot of documentaries and everything on it but one of the first times that I've flown was uh happened when uh you know we were in the air and it's like okay I'm taking my mind off of everything and rather than watching the altitude and that on the monitor what I did was uh is I, I put on uh, the discovery channel and that was a, that was a bad news that was a bad thing to do especially and when I was young and you know, susceptible to being, well, I'm still afraid. I'm still afraid. But, you know, I had like a little more of a fragile mind and more of a imaginative mind. So the, the, the documentary that was on was about 9-11. And that's not a video you really want to watch while you're flying, I guess. <laughs> so I quickly changed the hell out of that channel. And I basically watched uh discovery nature or whatever it's called where they they do stuff on animals rather than on 9-11 so suffice it to say i had a fairly uneasy flight and i honestly like i said i'm not a good flyer i hate when turbulence happens like my gut just instantly tightens up and i feel like i'm gonna throw up and i just i i hate flying so i don't know if i'm gonna talk to a doctor and maybe get myself prescribed something so i can keep calm a little bit but it's it's gonna be uh, kind of frightening. <laughs> it sounds so weird that I'm I'm admitting that I'm afraid of flying, but yeah, well, actually that brings up a good point. What things do you guys do on a normal basis, even though you you're afraid of it? Like me, I know like f I if I had a choice, I'd bust. But I mean, like busing is just takes for too long, and it's it's it, it's so inconvenient. So. Yeah, what, what what do you guys like to, or, you know, what, what what type of fears do you guys have, but yet you do on a daily basis, like flying for me, not a, not on a daily basis, but I mean, like, you know, you have to do it regardless, because I mean, like traveling to to Birmingham, Alabama, in a, in a bus would take about three or four days, so I th I'd rather fly for uh, four hours than uh, sit around for 72, so... Uh, it's just one of those things that I kind of just suck up and I'm just like, okay, fuck it. We're doing this live and then I'd end up doing it. But I'm going to take a quick look. I Like I said, yes, I'm sorry that uh, I, I know that this isn't going to be a very productive episode, but I had to talk about some stuff. And I also want to make sure that you guys are aware that certain things might not come out next week and on the, or the week from the 4th till the 11th. So, uh... Obviously, it'll, it'll look better when I have, like, the roof on and everything, but... Okay, that, that color is actually not too bad. I guess we can stick with it. Hmm. Yeah, actually, it's actually not too bad. But it does look a bit weird, just because there's, like, legitimately no roof on. But, yeah, like, to hear what you guys are afraid of, but do anyways. But, uh... As I said, it, guys, I do apologize, but just just remember that next week uh, there might not be some stuff, uh, you know, like my cryostasis, my uh, there will be some Mind Z for sure. There will be uh, some uh, 
uh, I don't know whether or not my, maybe some Minecraft, and if it is, it's going to be all pre-recorded. Uh, Mirror's Edge is going to be 100% there. And uh, I might do some other stuff as well, something that I can just kind of do rather because I mean, like, I treat my Minecraft more of a vlog than anything. So, you know, that that's why I don't want you guys to expect anything. Because, you know, I like to try and stay current and stay on top of uh, things that have been happening around the world and talk with you guys. But, you know, sometimes that doesn't happen. So, but uh, just quickly put up this fence, I guess. And and I think I might put vines around my house here. Let's take a look at this from the outside one more, one last time here. Because that's going to be like a little balcony. And we'll take a look. Oh. I don't know if I want like a couple floors like that. We'll see. I'll let you. I'll let you guys actually decide. Should I keep it like this, or should I go up like maybe two more floors or something? Because I, I like this area. It's starting to turn out really nice, actually. But anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Make sure that you guys are aware that some stuff might not come out next week or the fourth to eleventh, and I'll I'll let you guys know again from uh, the the week I'm off. But hope you guys enjoyed this nonetheless, and I shall talk to you guys later. Peace out, Girl Scouts.